Breaking right now, an apartment fire in West Garfield Park traps two people. One was forced to jump from a balcony and both were badly burned. CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli is live at Stroger Hospital where the two are being treated. Hi, and that fire broke out at around 3.15 this morning, just a few hours west of here. That's when officials say a female squatter became trapped on the third floor of an abandoned apartment building in West Garfield Park. Now, witnesses say they first heard a loud boom. Then they say flames started shooting out of the three-story apartment building. A woman became trapped, as we said, on that third floor. Now, she was screaming for her life. That's when a man who officials say was staying on the second floor, just below the woman, stepped out onto a wooden ledge. He asked her to drop from the third floor to the second floor where he said he would catch her. Now, after negotiating with her for about five minutes, the woman finally got up the courage and did indeed let go. Jonathan Anderson describes what happened next. It was raging. It was, it was real hot. She was screaming real loud. They was trying to tell her to get out. One guy had came up and he told her to uh, hang down and just drop, just hang and let yourself go. I'll catch you. He tried to catch her, but when he caught her, the wood had started to buckle and it broke and they collapsed and fell down to the bottom. Now, the man and woman were both taken here to Stroger in critical condition. At this point, it is not clear what touched off this blaze. The Office of Fire Investigation is on the scene as we speak over in West Garfield Park. About 60 firefighters in all responded to that fire. Reporting live outside the emergency room at Stroger, Mike Puccinelli, CBS 2 News. Aaron?